Dear viewers, escape the monotony of your job and embrace the excitement of data analytics. Discover Gaurav's inspiring career shift from HR to data analytics in Skillovilla's success stories. Gain valuable insights on the difference between data analytics and business analytics. Tune in to get inspired and chart your own path to success today. Hey, hi Gaurav. Hi Siddhi. How are you? I am doing great. Thank you for asking. How are you doing? I'm good as well. Thank you. So, Gaurav, first of all, thank you so much for doing this for us. I mean, I really appreciate that you're giving your valuable time for telling people about your story. And it's it's gonna be, you know, really helpful for all those viewers who, who are going to watch this and they're gonna take the inspiration from your story, definitely. So, before going forward with your learning journey at Skillovilla, let's dive deep into your background story. I mean, let's know more about you first. Like, so go back a little and understand about yourself, you know, before being a data analyst, what were you doing and how come you decided that, you know, you want to be a data analyst? Great. So I'll start with my introduction. So I'm a certified data analyst and currently working into quantum finance in Mumbai. This job I got from Skillovilla support. So I'm currently working as a business analyst here. Previous to this, I was working into HR development. I was into the talent acquisition team and I worked for pretty two years or something into domestic and international work. And after a certain time, the job became monotonous for me and I felt of uh, switching into information technology IT sector. So I was going through the technologies, uh, the job profiles in IT and I came across data and this to be an intimidating profile for me, an interesting one. So I then starting, I started searching for uh, institutes that provide the course for data analysis. And on Instagram, I came uh, across this ad of Skillovilla. And uh, then I went to the website, saw the curriculum. I like the structured uh, curriculum. I like how they have designed the website so that a learner could understand how well he can learn uh, all the skills in Skillovilla once enrolled. And then I enrolled for Skillovilla's course. Oh, all right. Thank you for giving us such an like insightful answer. Uh, so I have a question here, Gaurav, actually. So uh, you have done a data analytics course, but you know, you are now a business analyst at a company. So uh, can you tell us the difference between the two? Because a lot of us, you know, get confused between should I be a business analyst? Should I be data analyst? And if I want to do one of them, then what kind of course should I opt for? Sure. So business analyst is a more non-tech term, but again, it depends on company to company. In my company, I am, my profile is as a business analyst, but I'm doing combined role of a business analyst and a data analyst. The profile of business analyst is uh, like a coordinator. He's the coordinator between the client, understanding the technical requirements, and then sharing it with their, his technical team to develop the product. He's kind of a mediator, but here at uh, Quantum Finance, my job is as a business analyst and data analyst same. So I am the person understanding the technical requirements with the client and I am the only person who is developing uh, the software or the analysis for them. This is the major difference. Uh, business analyst is a more non-tech kind of job. Data analyst is purely tech job. Okay, got it. So, but it's like, you know, even if you are not from a technical background, you can still pursue data analyst and you can, you can still. Yes, yes, yes. I am, I'm not from a mechanic, I am uh, from a mechanical background. I was not from a technical background and I've worked two uh, years into HR and then I've transitioned. So anyone can transition into data analysis, business analysis, data science. Okay. So what I can infer is that, you know, technical skills are not required if you want to be a data analyst. You can be data analyst without uh, the technical knowledge. It's important uh, that, you know, you should just have, you should have the willingness to learn. Now, it doesn't matter if you have those kind of skill set. The program is there that is going to help you in that. Okay, moving forward. So, uh, Gaurav, how was your learning experience at Skillovilla? And like, you know, what were the unique features of the curriculum did you like the most? I like the syllabus very, the structured design of the syllabus is very good. Any person from any background can easily understand from beginner to advance whatever is being taught. So that is the best thing I feel about Skillovilla. Plus, there are mentors, there are uh, special classes on weekends. The industry experts are there to teach you about what is happening in the industry, how they are using data analysis on day-to-day -day basis. 
so that is again very interesting that is again the best part of skillovilla that it has plus the community you have 60 plus people in your batch to help you every now and then with your assignments any doubts so yeah these things i like the most great regards so like you mentioned about the live classes which happens on weekends Life classes basically helps you in you know understanding the practical knowledge of what you have already learned theoretically through the curriculum. So since you mentioned about those life classes which happens on weekends, I'm I'm sure you must be having your favorite mentor in the curriculum whose class you you know you like the most. And can you tell us more about that particular mentor and you know what different what difference you feel in his classes or her classes than others? Okay, so all of the mentors are really great at Skillovilla. One specific mentor which I feel a connect with is Naman Naman Jain from Swiggy. His way of teaching is very different. Also, he makes you understand the toughest technical terms very easy. Okay. So that is the best part uh, I like about him. Also, is very close to my age. Uh, that is why I resonate with him easily, and I vibe with him. After classes, also he is very helpful. Like you can message him. He has given his WhatsApp number, email address. You can message him, email him any time with any of your technical queries, and he will respond. Okay. So that is the best. That is what I feel. Okay, great. I I can imagine those must be you know mentorship sessions would be very intense and very knowledgeable because you know you get to know those practical learnings and. how you going to you know what's happening in the industry actually and how you going to apply all those things so what of are there like any relevant industry skill sets that you acquired from the program which you know you which is kind of helping you in your current job role uh yeah statistical analysis is one of the most important part is what i feel taught at skillovilla and which is being used in industry for data analysis mm-hmm. so that uh, skill is what i feel is the important one all right all right it's not it wasn't that you know you were you know only you know giving your time to the curriculum there must be some other work that you know you must be busy with and it it we have both kind of people on our platform the working professionals and the students as well and it's it's obvious that you know people will be busy with some or the other thing so whenever you used to get doubts or queries how do you you know manage to get those things resolved First thing I would say, all of us are busy, and I was working as an HR full time, so it it was a very limited time to study. But if you give one to two hours daily for this course, mm-hmm. you will be the best data analyst in the batch. Only one to two hours daily is what you require. Plus about the doubts you have now, I guess they have started the Discord uh, group. They had the Telegram group at my time. So there you post your question and everyone in your batch will answer it if you have any mm-hmm. if it still is there if no one is able to resolve it you have a special doubt resolution classes on saturdays there you can put up your doubt and they will be surely resolving so yeah, there is no problem with having doubt or the time frame the time frame you require is only 1 to 2 hours day that's what we actually expect from the students as well who who are you know uh, studying from skillovilla's curriculum If you invest just just like one or two hours on a daily basis, you will be you know up to date. You will be able to complete your assignments. You will be able to complete your milestones, which is gonna help you in getting certified from the platform. Sure. So not much of the time is required for you know going through the curriculum basically. All right. So now let's go further and let's talk about your placement journey. How was your placement experience here at Skillo Villa? and uh, can you just elaborate more about what all processes were there before you you know actually got placed in the company right so the important thing is you have to get your certification first without that you cannot sit for the placement which is very correct without having the certification you actually should not sit for the placement so certification is important secondly submitting your assignments and completing your assignments by your own is very important then you get the technical skills these two processes were, would be there the next thing is a uh, resume building which is a very important session so there you get to know how a data analyst resume should be built from scratch and then they have the mock interviews which is again a very good thing to prepare you for the actual interviews in future so those uh, three to four processes are important and post that you start with your placements 
so my experience was uh, after getting my certification it took around 5 months for me to get my first interview call which is a big time frame is what people will think but at that time the market was very slow for data analyst so i do not blame anyone for these 5 months uh, these 5 months were very crucial for me to keep on learning and keep on practicing whatever and the best thing is i have cracked my first interview directly I, it did not take me any inter- more times of interviews to get a placement because of skillovilla's course i learned everything in those 5 months i had uh, time to again revise it and in my first interview itself i was able to crack the interview and get the job great insight the market is not stable all the time right you know there is a recession that's happening so there's a lot of layoffs that are happening you know getting person placed on that circumstances is like you know a pretty challenging for us but you know we take that challenge positively and you know ensure that every student get right kind of opportunity and every student should get equal opportunity and should be placed in their dream companies all right so gorav as a final word is there anything that you would like to recommend to all those um, data analysts and data science seekers you know who are looking forward to join skillovilla's career track yeah sure so one uh, important point that i would like to highlight here is join the skillovilla course it is the best course i have been through but do not rely on skillovilla completely to get a placement work hard yourself skillovilla is putting their 100% it is your responsibility to put your 100% so that you get placed and trust me if you put your 100% you are going to get placed in a very good company through skillovilla Sure. rightly put gorav like you know it's not it doesn't go it it always goes hand in hand it's not only the one team that is putting up their efforts and you know you'll get something out of it be it here be it anywhere wherever you anyone is going to go they you have to put in your 100% efforts and if you are consistent and if you are, have that willingness to do it then definitely you will be certified and you will definitely crack the job because ultimately you are the person who is going to give the interview and going to answer those questions we can just help you with you know become the industry oriented person and you know you you are able to answer those questions that is you know be going to be asked in the interview and through mock interviews we this is what we are you know trying to achieve so great gorav thank you so much for joining us and giving such an honest and insightful interview and we wish you the best for your future and if in case you know you need any kind of assistance from skillovilla just give us a call ping us anywhere you have connections here and you know who to reach out to so we will always be there to help you out thank you so much for having me the pleasure was mine thank you all right gorav thank you so much collaborate with the skillovilla community today